Okay, in this video, we're going to talk about slide transition. What slide transition is, is going to be able to move to the slide or move to the next slide automatically. I want to run my show right now. I want to pick on the view and then slideshow. Here's the first slide of our presentation. Notice how it's not moving on to the next slide. I would have to click or maybe you can hit the left arrow button uh, or the right arrow button to go to the next or previous slide. Now you can see this slide has the animation that we covered in the previous video. But let's say we want to go to the next slide automatically. That's called a slide transition. The way you do this is you're going to pick on the animations menu and then over here we did the custom animation that's on a different video. But for the rest of this animations uh, menu we have the slide transition. Okay, these have uh, transition effects. So you, you want to try some of these. So when it goes to the next slide, uh, you can add some of these effects in. It, you know, makes the presentation a little bit more interesting. I'm going to try the checkerboard one. Now, when it goes to the next slide, you can even add a sound. Uh, I'm going to try the camera. The, slide, the transition effect can pay uh, slow, medium, or fast. Let's try slow and you'll always see it better. Now, here's the important part. If you want it to be manual, you're going to keep it on, on mouse click. However, if you want it to be automatic, then you're going to say automatically after so many seconds. So let's say after, uh, four sec uh, after three seconds. Now, I actually like to keep both of those checked because this way, even if it's on automatic mode, then I, I can still move to the next slide by uh, clicking or by using one of the keyboard uh, arrows. So I actually like to keep both of those on so I still have control over it. Now, if I just wanted that to be for the current slide, then I wouldn't do anything else. But if I say apply to all, that means every slide will move to the next slide after three uh, seconds and all of the other effects will be in, uh, in effect. Let's go to apply to all. Now let's see what the presentation looks like this time. I'm going to pick on slideshow and then from beginning. Here's the first slide. Now notice how three seconds later it automatically went to the next slide and now this one has the animation. Now, I'm, um, see how the animation is going now. We did this in a different video. We, uh, uh, if you look for a video that's called animation, it shows you exactly how to make those effects appear. But notice how now it went to the next slide. Now, this slide has text animation. There's another slide, there's another video that says text animation. Now, you can see it went to the next slide, and then the next slide. And then we have, this is uh, one more and then we, it gets to the end of the show. So notice how it moves to the slides automatically. That was because of the slide transition. At this case, I'm going to hit the escape key. Now, notice at the end there, it, it stopped at the last slide. Sometimes you want to keep it going. You want to make it loop. Here's how you do that. You're going to pick on slideshow, the slideshow menu, and you're going to say set up show. And then you're going to pick on loop continuously until you press escape. So that way, when it gets to the last slide, it'll just start again at the first slide. Loop continuously until you press escape. In fact, it'll keep on going. Now, at this point, uh, the way I did it was slideshow, setup show, loop continuously. Let's go ahead and run it now. I'll say view, slideshow. Now, I'm going to click on these so we can just skip through. I'm just clicking so it goes through a little bit quicker. Now here's the last slide and then notice how it went right back to the first slide. So let's say you have a kiosk at the mall or you have a trade show booth and uh, or sometimes I use this for if I have an audience as the audience is sitting down I give them something to watch so I let the presentation just loop. And it's very effective. It's going to keep on playing until I hit the escape key. Now, um, see how the presentation is going. If you want to pause it, you can hit the S key on your keyboard. Like right now, I'm going to hit the S key. And what that does is it stops it on that slide so that you can um, maybe talk about that individual slide, answer questions. 
I'm going to hit the S key again and then you're going to see that it's going to continue. All right, so it just went out. Now, this is the last slide, and now it's going to go back to the first slide because of the looping. I'm going to hit the escape key here. When I hit the escape key, it really does stop. So what we covered in that video was we covered uh, how to do the tri uh, slide transition. That was under the animations menu. We also had to, showed you how to do looping with the slideshow and then with the uh, setup show and you say loop continuously. And then when we were running the show, I also showed you how to pause it by hitting the S key on your keyboard. So these are all great ways to manage your uh, presentation.